Remnants of Southport High School basketball star Louis Dampier are all over his alma mater. Pictures of championships hang in the hallways, but it wasn't until Friday night, 50 years after the Indiana All-Star had graduated from the Indianapolis school in 1963, did Dampier have the ultimate respect paid to him in front of his family and teammates in a packed Southport gymnasium. His number 32 was officially hung in the rafters. It's such an honor to have it retired, not only to do that, but to be the first in the history of Southport to have a number retired. It's, it's very special. After graduation, Dampier attended the University of Kentucky, where the two-time All-American finished runner-up in the 1966 championship game. And then Dampier joined the ABA and became a Kentucky Colonel. After nine years, Dampier became the league's all-time leading scorer and led the Colonels to their lone championship in the 1975 season. But the memory of Dampier that had everyone talking on Friday night was the game winner over Washington in the 1963 sectional championship. Third into one of their big guys, and he took the ball like this over his shoulder, and I ran behind him, knocked it out, and went down. And I, supposedly, I, they say I could have had a layup, but I stopped for the shot instead of going in for a layup. Though Dampier accomplished a lot after he left Southport High School in the neighboring state of Kentucky, he will always remember where home court is, right here in the state of Indiana. You know, Indiana is the basketball state and always has been. Indiana is still in my heart. A lot of people, when they used to interview me because I played at Kentucky, and they always asked me what school I went to in Kentucky. And I corrected them immediately and said, no, I'm a Hoosier. I went to Southport High School in Indianapolis. And though Southport lost to Perry Meridian 50-39 to on Friday night, February 1st will always be remembered as Louis Dampier Day. Ken Sothman, Fox 59 Sports.